forged in fire, born in thunder. For centuries, artillery cannons have been the backbone of armies, deciding wars, toppling empires, shaping nations. But here's the terrifying truth. A cannon is a weapon that must survive its own explosion. Tell me in the comments right now. Would you dare to stand behind a weapon that might explode in your face? Type yes if you would, or no if you never would. Stay with me, because the journey from raw ore to battlefield thunder will reveal how fragile power truly is. The first cannons were crude tubes of iron and bronze filled with powder and hope. In the 14th century, kings gambled with weapons that often killed their own crews. Misfires, explosions, molten shards tearing men apart. But armies still risked everything because even an imperfect cannon could shatter walls and terrify enemies. This was the birth of firepower. So, tell me below, were these cannons miracles of technology or monsters of war? I'll turn your answers into a poll. Sorry, Skangs. What is that? Ross. Look at him. This is not good. Raw iron ore is melted in furnaces, blazing hotter than volcanic magma. Rivers of molten steel flow into massive molds, each casting a cannon barrel as heavy as a house. Sparks rain down like fiery stars. But molten steel is treacherous, too brittle, and the cannon shatters, too soft, and it bends under pressure. The foundry is both creation and destruction. Would you dare stand near a furnace holding the firepower of nations? If this shot makes your jaw drop, hit like so more people can see the danger behind creation. Casting is only the beginning. Cannons are forged under hammers the size of trucks. Red-hot barrels are beaten, compressed, hardened, their grain aligned to resist unimaginable stress. Every strike is thunder. Every mistake is death. Metallurgists know a hidden crack inside the barrel 
is a silent assassin. One day, on the battlefield, it will kill without warning. If you knew one flaw could destroy everything, how carefully would you forge your cannon? Comment no cracks if you'd never risk it. Oh no, this can't be good. A cannon is not just brute force. Its barrel must be bored with surgical precision. Millimeters decide life or death. Giant drills carve the heart of steel, cutting smooth the chamber where fire will be born. Too wide, the cannon leaks power. Too tight, the barrel bursts. Precision is survival. Would you trust your life to a weapon drilled by human hands? Drop a yes or no in the comments. I want to see the split. Every cannon must endure tests of fire. The barrel is heated, cooled, stressed until its limits are revealed. Flames roar, steel screams, gauges measure pressure beyond comprehension. Some barrels pass, others crack, splinter, and are scrapped like corpses on a battlefield. If you were a soldier, would you stand behind a cannon untested by fire? Comment only tested fire if you demand proof. Now comes the body. Wheels, carriages, recoil systems. Each bolt, each rivet tested, tightened, locked. A cannon is a marriage of brute force and delicate mechanics. But if even one bolt fails in battle, the weapon becomes a killing machine against its own soldiers. So tell me, do you want us to cover modern tank cannons next? Write tank cannons in the comments and I'll make it happen.
last, the cannon faces judgment. It is hauled to a proving ground. Charges are packed, fuses lit, soldiers take cover, the earth shakes, the sky cracks with thunder. If the cannon survives, it joins the army. If it fails, it explodes in shame and fire. What would you feel standing in that moment? Pride or fear? Comment with a single word. Pride or fear? Cannons changed history. They toppled castles, silenced knights, and unleashed wars of fire. From Napoleon's grand batteries to the trenches of Verdun, cannons defined battle. Today, artillery evolves into self-propelled giants, rocket barrages, even rail guns powered by electricity. But the truth remains, Every cannon is still a barrel daring to survive its own explosion. Will future cannons make war unstoppable, or will they make humanity uninhabitable? Write your thoughts. I pure fi the best answers in a future video. A forged in fire, shaped by steel, tested in thunder. The cannon is the very definition of power and danger. A weapon that must survive death to deliver death. If you've stayed with me to the end, comment Forged in Firepower and join the Firepower crew. Subscribe to 360 Global Process because the machines that decide war are still being built right now. And next, we reveal the terrifying story of artillery shells. The bullets of these beasts.